I didn't know it was going to be in episodes. I thought it was short playthroughs every time, so I'm curious to see if it's a... Seems like it's an ongoing story that leads up to Election Day, which I actually didn't know. But let's jump in with Episode 2 and see how it handles it. Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to The Sonia Show. As many of you know, the Brigades have a secret mobile radio station which they use to spread their fake news. Sounds well, like a robot. for years, the person transporting the station has evaded capture. But viewers, I've learned the authorities are closing in and now believe the station is being moved by a truck driver. We remind you there's a $2,000 reward for any valuable information. Come on, people. Let's bring this criminal to Papa justice. Papa Bear, maybe. Now, let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. Surprisingly, Politics. it does appear Flores has some supporters. Probably members of the brigades. As you know, the Sonya show feel like this reporter is, is a little biased. concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing team report. Okay. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia hotline. Last scene, walking along the road. Wait, what? Hang on. <gasps> Am I choosing my character here, who I'm going to play next? The hotline is available 24 what? hours, seven days a week. That's so cool. Let's bring these teens back home. Um, let's be... I was a girl on the first step. Let's be this 18-year-old looks like a boy. Last scene from the border, stealing a car. Let's be a criminal. Sounds exciting. Oh, that's so cool. I love how it did that. That was, like, seamless. So there's my route for that first episode. And now we go to a story over here. The soundtrack is pretty great in this game. It's already got claimed on YouTube, but hopefully they release it. Can't turn the music off though. It's like too good. I'd rather just not have adverts or, you know. Thanks for the ride, homie. Oh, hello, now Alex. I got time to work on this game. Uh, aren't you a little young? You're one to talk. That quote-unquote mustache isn't fooling anyone. How dare you. Just drop me someplace with free electricity, okay? Need to charge my How many super is that a lot of miles? tech in the back. Mm-hmm. Alex's backpack full of dope tech designs for even more dope Go. tech. Go on. Ask me a question. I can multitask like an mf -er. An mf -er. Um... How do we cross the border? I don't want to escape myself. But I know a guy who knows a guy who knows a girl who crossed using some secret tunnels at the border. Um, this time, Flores will destroy it. Do you know what? Let's be like pro Flores on this one. Doesn't matter because she's never gonna win. Can gonna I wasn't let it political happen. at all last time. Now, let me get back to this beta. 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 Road trip. Your moon boots on. Kick your shoes off if you're in the car for a long time, right? In this heat? This thing doesn't look like it's got air con. Check it. Beta complete. What was that? Uh yeah, that was, that was fast. I sell my games, you know. Built that computer too. One day, everyone will have a computer like that. Mmm, too small. I'm telling you, small computers are nah, the future. Don't believe Hungry? it. Ask your small computer for food. Lost? Ask your small computer for direction. Nonsense. Talking absolute nonsense. Sci-fi stuff. You can't talk to computers. You'll see, Home Slice. You'll see. Yo, are we gonna play this bad boy or not? Uh, we played this on the demo. It's like a little tank game. Do you know what? I'm just trying to get out of the country, Alex. Like, I love your game, No reason but... you can't have some fun doing it. Know what I'm saying? Right. Just five minutes. It's called Furious Tanks. You got tanks, and they're furious. You're blue. This is easy mode. Red tank can't fire. You're it's going like down. You to blow it up. Uh. 
I love how this is filled with mini games. Wait, why aren't you, Alex? I'm hitting your thing here. Blow up. You got skills. Now we play. I think my favorite thing from the first episode was the Alex trombone playing mini game. Gloves. Even though, as far as rhythm games go, it was awful. It was just pretty amusing. Ouch. Yo, maybe we can make it better. Maybe the player has to gather ammo. Maybe the bullets bounce off the walls. What do you think? Let's go with bouncing bullets. Let me just. Boom! Game time, dog. Computer whiz. Oh, I gotta turn it down because it's so loud. Can I blow myself up? No. Ow. So, what do you think? And be honest. I hate liars. Um, I mean, this is 1996. I like it the way it is. Okay, but I'm trusting you on this, man. So, what do you think now? It's it's great. Can I go back to driving? <laughs> uh, it's great. Nice. Here's an advance on the profits, and there are sure to be profits. Wait, I ain't playing around. You give me money. Twenty dollars. Yo, one day one hundred people will play the same game at the same time. You're crazy. Gonna have to stop you right there, Alex. Nah, I'm telling you. No way, man. Yeah, maybe you're right. Petria, man. It's like we're living in the dark ages. This zoom is my favorite thing. Because the models and stuff, the graphics look so nice. It's really nice to zoom in and get a really nice shot. Uh, are your parents programmers or something? Oh. Are you okay? It's... It's all good, homie. It's just... I don't know my parents. Not my real parents, anyway. Oh, sorry. You know the attack in 86? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I think my bio parents died in the attack, too. Sorry. The really sad part is, I got no memories of them. None. No matter how hard I try, I just have this picture. Let me see. A picture of a man and woman taken on September the 9th, 1986, the day of the attack. Alex believes they are his biological parents. Cute. It's from GNN, the day of the attack. They appear for just one sec. I learned a lot about computers enhancing this. Enhance. Um, wow, it's actually impressive. Thanks, homie. Guess I needed to talk and didn't know it. That'll be 20 bucks. <laughs> 20 bucks? That's steep. That's okay, you already paid and me. That's why I'm on the road. They're probably gone. You know, buried underneath the rocks. But I want to find out as much about them as I can. Yeah, like stuff is locked still. Uh, good luck. Thanks, man. You can drop me off with the next I think you have to location. replay it to get those options. Yo, your fuel is low, dog. You're gonna run out of gas fast. Damn, homie. Well, this isn't even my car. I know that. Think I'm blind? Now, crank some music. We best ride in style. Yeah. So that is like a little chapter, and I guess you get a different one every time, or I wonder if that's the same every time someone plays it. Still a character I haven't met there. The taxi driver. We need to get a taxi at some point. Whoa. My energy is really low. Super low. What's up, Python? How are you doing today? 
border patrol groups, eh? out my rage I am I'm being a vandal oh my gosh someone might live here this is naughty I mean I guess I don't have to do it but I mean there's a bat there and a lot of things to hit so why wouldn't I you know it's, it's someone else's fault, it's not mine. Don't, don't leave a bat there if you don't want me to smash the place up, you know? Uh, just passing. You've been breaking things, haven't you? That's not very nice. Hey, personal bubble, personal bubble. Um, don't mess with me, man. I'm scaring you, aren't I? Sorry. Follow me. I want to show you something. I would never. Impressive, isn't it? What? What? The brigades used to live here. In fact, this is where they planned the attack. In 86. You remember? Don't insult me. But someone I loved was. Tyrak found it after the attack. Those still here were arrested. How many were never heard from again? Is that a dinosaur? I see. Go on. Take a look around. What if this is Alex's dad? What are these little mini dinosaurs? Looks like they were playing dinosaur D&D. &D. Hmm, why can't I? Happy taxi. So this guy's a taxi driver. Is this a dino park? This huge thing? That's what they called the radio tree. They used it to make their radio broadcasts. You're looking at what allowed them to recruit their members. Money. Uh, cool. That's what I wanted to show you. I... I think we should break it. Mmm... What? I said we should break it. Right, I don't know. I said break it, or I'll find something else to break. Okay. You're the boss. I mean, the boss of me, we should break it. Why is he... Why is he so anti... Oh, I guess if he, someone he loved was with them, then they died, right? So he hates the organization, rather than being pro-government, I think. It's like uh, Street Fighter bonus level when you're being up the car. Yeah, his voice is... something else, huh? I like to smoke after therapy. Okay. Do you know anything about karma? What goes around comes around. I know that. I guess Tyrax karma is bad then. <sighs> Why do you hate them? Well, they took Lola, his wife. Who's Lola? Lola was my daughter. Oh. The brigades. Took her away from me. What happened? She was just 16 when she joined them. Her biology teacher, Bob Winters, Hell recruited yeah. her. I thought that was she in the game. Always liked Bob. <laughs> it's like, who's arriving? I thought someone had come around the corner. Imagine that, someone's telling a sad story. Hell yes. Just listening in. Uh, Oren, thank you so much for 61 months with the Prime. I appreciate it, dude. That was great. 
I'm saving him for a last. For last? Never mind. Today's a day for healing. Full sigh or lazy eye? What do you think? She was just a kid, huh? Hmm. She was. I'm trying to work out. When the day came for the attack in 86, they sent her what and the some voice other reminds members me of. to the wall. The detonation didn't go as planned, I guess. And she was buried beneath the rocks. Sling blade. That's what it reminds me of. <laughs> mm, some folks call her sling blade. I call her Kai's blade. Let's smash this radio tower. Um, sorry. She wanted to be a paleontologist. Someone who studies dinosaurs. She knew everything about them there was to know. What a nerd. Their names, what they ate, everything. That's her camper. Yeah, of course she decorated it with dinosaurs. You know, people usually decorate this was a mistake. on the inside. What, what do you mean? It didn't help. None of it. What didn't? Destroying the tree. Talking. Talking. It only made things worse. You should run. Run. And this guy's crazy. I'm leaving. So what I know from the first episode is that the guys, the bank robbers on the bikes, they think that this guy is a killer. And they're trying to find him. They think he's on his way to kill Sonya. Which after meeting him is probably true. Oh. What the heck was that? Is that a gunshot? Uh... Or is he just smashing the place up? Let's leave, huh? Yeah, there's his taxi cab. Alright, let's uh, steal this car. And a key. Uh, hitchhike. It is June 22nd, but we're on the road. Jared. J Rod. I've been kept inside so long. I've lost sight of red and Cut scene. Mm -hmm. Trombone girl. Left an open door. I feel like a, a trombone is the weirdest one to take with you if you were traveling like that, right? Given all the hostility, it's normal the police would get violent. Wait, you're saying the police are justified in using violence? Like it's not like a guitar slung on your back? A trombone. I'm glad you're here. Now I'm not the only one subjected to this. Sure. Oh, we've got to play Connect 4. Let me look under the seat. 59% chance of succeeding at looking under the seat. Ah, what do we have here? What do they say? Tyrak gives you $20 to cheer our president. I don't know if this is pro-propaganda or anti, but... Uh, thanks for the ride. People are looting, Jeff. What good will come of that? Looting is reasonable when the system is so broken. Do you think they always talk like this? It's their foreplay? Gross, dude. Sorry. <laughs> I guess I can't have this conversation with you, can I? So, you're one of us, aren't you? 
yeah. I knew you were a crosser, like me. I can smell it on you, literally. Okay. Let's talk about something else then. Think they know what we're really up to? Nah. Yeah, no way. So, I got an idea. Mm, uh oh. <laughs> Shut up. Let's play this game I found and listen to some music. Here, take my Walkman. <laughs> Wait, have you played before? Connect like Four. My opponent's strength Are we playing Connect Four? Them. If your idea is to play Connect Four, you don't say, "I have an idea." Like we're about to get up to no good. You just say, "Do you want to play a game of Connect Four? Uh, yeah, I'm kind of amazing at this. <laughs> a challenge. I like that. Sorry, why is that? You put headphones on me. You play trombone. I mean, the trombone's cool. I'm just saying, it's a, if somebody pulled one out around a campfire. I'm just like, be like, what is happening? You ready to get crushed? Uh, no, don't go there. Let's connect the four. I'm gonna go. Hey, hey, hey! No. No, no. Yes, yes. What? I win, oh, but I no always way. win. Whatever. Want a rematch? Yes. To bring it back. Okay, that's the fours coming up there. Wait for it to go there. Yes, yes. No, no, I see what you're trying to do and it's not going to work. Now you've blocked me off. What are you doing? What are you, what are you trying to pull? Huh? So, nope. Right, okay, blocked off again. No! Oh, for God's sake. And that's the win. So, do you like the music? Don't worry about hurting my feelings. I'm a big girl. Actually annoyed. I've got all kinds of tapes. Here, so you remember me. The brothers. Okay. Why are you... Why do you want to cross? To start a new life. No. To have a life. My dad thinks I'm lucky to have a big house and go to a prep school, but I'm not. Believe me. She's a rich girl. Um, things tough with dad? Yeah, you could say that. Some good old fashioned daddy Look, issues. I'm gonna tell you something, okay? All right. Maybe I shouldn't, but I feel like I can trust you. Listening. My father is the minister of oil. Oh, what? No way. Keep it down. Did you kids say something? She said her dad's uh, the minister of... Uh, just that you have a great band? Oh. Uh, the secret's safe with me. Thanks. Uh, I feel better now that I've told someone. I wanted to tell this one kid, but we got kicked out of our campground before I could. That was me in episode one. Uh, can you go back to thinking of me like you did before? Um, how did I think about you? As this exquisite being you're lucky to share oxygen with? Right. I'll try. Thanks. Hey, kids. Uh-oh. Good luck. Can I ask you something? <laughs> Can you ask it whilst you face forward? You don't know who turns around in their chair like this to talk to someone in the back seat. Yes? I was wondering, would you say you're political? Uh, no. Not really. What about you? Freaking me out, man. I, I am, yeah. I thought so. I mean, isn't that why you're leaving the country? And don't deny that you are. What do you mean? You're leaving because you think the country has problems. Uh, you an agent? You a knock, man? <laughs> Jeff, an undercover agent. What? I could be an undercover agent. Anyway, because you are leaving, you two are political, at least according to me. 
uh, end. So since you are... Jeff! Almost done. What are you gonna do to change this place? I'm gonna vote, man. It could work. I'm not sure. The system might be broken. What's certain is that it's the youth who are going to make change happen. If it happens at all. Finally, we agree on something. We will change the country. Happy to hear you say that. Uh. Oh no, road control. You go over the speed limit? No, I mean, I don't think so. Oh my God, they just rammed into the back of us. The fire though, the fuzz. Everyone stay calm. Kids, let now that's us do the talking. We'll talk if we want. No problem. I think they have our back. Road control, ma'am. License and registration. <laughs> Happy to help. You're not allowed to can, leave the sir. country, so. Sir, he's nothing but a road control zombie. Shh, you're trying to get us in trouble, Zoe. Those are your kids? No, sir. Just giving them a ride. I see. Should have said we were your kids. What are you? What are you doing? Hello. <laughs> are you all right, son? You seem a little nervous. Yeah, I'm fine, man. Say, you look like one of the kids on the missing posters. Not me. Well, just to be sure, I'll need to see your papers. What if we were to make a donation to road control, sir? A donation? Yeah, we could do that. Well, for a donation, I suppose I could look the other way. Thank you, officer. Wait, wait, you're not really going to pay this guy, are you? Sally, shut up. Uh, they're just trying to help. It's people like you that are ruining this country. Excuse me? Be quiet. Can we just... Zoe, we just need to get out of here. It really doesn't matter if he takes $20 to not arrest us right now. Oh, come on! This turd in a uniform isn't <gasps> going to do anything! A turd? Oh, You're no. She's, not, she's going to the what big you house done, now. Zoe? Uh, don't touch me, What pig. do we do? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Not the trombone! Do what he says. We gotta help. I warned you, didn't I? I will not stand by whilst innocent instruments are thrown down. Wait, what? I don't get put in the back of the car as well. Hey, why does she get arrested and I just get left on the side of the road? Rude. Trying to get thrown in a cell together over here. What are you doing? Oh my God. I'm completely out of energy. I need to find some food or something. I don't even know what happens if you run out. About to find out. What do we have here? Oh boy. Looks like one of the kids on the posters. Let's take him in. Damn. You've been arrested. No one said it would be easy to reach the border, let alone cross it. But for one journey that ends, others are only beginning. I feel like we didn't even, oh my God, arrested. I feel like we didn't even have an option to find food on that run, actually. That was pretty tough. Well, that kid didn't make it. Simped too hard, went to jail. Next kid. 
Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. That's cool that it can like end and you can sort of have an episode game over, but carry on. Is Lupe Flores funding the brigades or vice versa? There's no evidence to suggest that yet, but I'll keep looking. Turn in jail. Yesterday, I had the honor to interview our Minister of Oil. Hey, we met that guy's the kid. Ceremony for a new pump. Also, do you know what? That is privilege because she'll be arrested, right? And then, the, then she'll get out because of who her dad is, and I'll stay in jail forever. Oh my God, what a classic! Let's take a moment to look at the latest. Because she gets arrested being like pig. You turd. Looks like and then is still one cool and she'll be out. Candidate. And I'll languish in jail for the rest of my days. Has some supporters. All her fault. Probably members of the Rich girl vibes. As you know, the Sonia show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Okay. Remember, if you have <gasps> this person looks cool. Please call Got some cool Sonya shades hotline. on. And a hat. Missing for nine days, 20 days. Oh, it even says how much energy they start with. Look. We're like picking each time. The hotline is available I think we should go with the one that has more energy this Let's time because back home. I don't want to end up in jail again. So we have more energy, but look, we're 1,900 from the border and this one is only 1,200 from the border. Hmm... We count on your support. Let's... What do you think? Two energy and be close to the border or further away. Let's... Take a good hard look. Let's be a young'un. Let's be a ute with two energy, but that might and be risky. This might not end well for us. Yeah, I think the stuff that we're doing as we play is affecting the election. Yo, welcome to my dope ride. Hi, Alex again. <laughs> are those what are, are those cans or something? What is that on the things? Can you reach the pedals? Yeah, I made these special platform shoes. Okay. And I got tech to spot the fuzz, so don't sweat that none either. Alex's small handmade computer, oh, yeah. yo. What? Chill, homie. Gotta say something, homegirl. Don't be one of those weirdo silent riders. Okay. Um, any tips? Yeah. Be careful with what you eat. Finding Try to tapes. avoid rotting food. But, you know, beggars can't always be choosers and all that. But you said bears can't be choosers. Do you have any food in here? I'm pretty low on energy. Hey man, uh, if Flores wins, we'll all eat better, you know? True, true. Alex? Dang, I think that's X Mom. X Mom? Yeah, she adopted me when I was four, then treated the me real well, but homie needed to make a change. Sounds complicated. Yeah, my life's real complicated. You seem upset. I am. She told me my bio parents were brigades. She knew that, but she never said nothing for 10 years. Maybe she had her reasons. Like what, yo? Like the truth would hurt? It did. But she made it hurt worse. So that's why she's ex-mom. And that's why I ran away and I'm on the road. Alex? Alex? Help. Please. She needs help. Me too. But it could be some kind of trick. Ex-mom is cunning, yo. Check the scanner at your feet. Mm hmm. Alex? Are you there? Can you hear me? Alex? Come in. Alex? You there? Alex? Got any tunes? I need your help. Right there, yo. What you want, ex mom? Oh, thank God. Baby, we got a call. The bank near our home is being robbed. I know things aren't great between us right now, but I need you to do your thing 
and access his cameras and tell me what you see. You should do it. Fine. I'll help you with my super dope tech. But that's the last time, woman. Thank you, baby. <laughs> Big Dog is not a baby. I'm Big Dog, woman. Can I help? I'm gifted, but I can't do everything. You gotta get in the back. Yeah, I'm in the intel game, yo. Big Brother is watching us, so I'm watching Big Brother. You're, you're, you're a real little superhero. What, what now? Tweet the antennas to make the image clear, and tell me what you see. Ex-mom, give us a sec. I'm driving and homegirl is in the back. You're what? Yo, chill. Chill, woman. Oh, it's gonna be Stan and Mitch, isn't it? That's pretty good. We see two burglars, ex -ma. Male. Got it. You see any hostages? Okay. This is a little... Turn it down a bit so loud. And aim for this one. Oh, come on. That's good enough. No hostages. Zero hostages, ex -ma. Good. Anything else? How they all link like Pulp Fiction. Yeah, it's really cool. Like, even just up to this point, we know that we've met this woman that's on the radio and stuff in the first app. <laughs> and homegirl says they're kind of dumb. <laughs> oh, not these guys again. Okay, I'll relay all of this. Thank you, baby. Yo. I'm a bit tongue-tied with Exma. <gasps> Food, yes. Too energy. Um, say you'll call her back soon. Come on, Alex. You look like thirteen. Look, I'll call you soon. Okay? Okay, baby. Sounds good, Alex. Yeah. You know I love you, right? Yeah. I know. Bye, ex-mom. Sorry you had to see that homegirl. Drama, you know? You're being kind of harsh on her, though. Maybe. Maybe I am being rough on her. Life. It's complicated. Especially when you're 14 and a genius. Anyway, thanks for helping me and ex Ma back there. Sure. Look at us, two teenagers on the road of life. Two fly homies. <clears throat> you know, I feel kind of stupid when I say something like that and you don't respond, Alex. You just left me hanging. I was trying to join in with your pattern of speaking and you just, uh, you just left me out there. Right, uh, yeah, sure. Drop me off whenever, huh? Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> That's literally the equivalent of I went, two fly homies, and held my hand up for a high five and they just stared at me. Okay. Sure. No worries, home slice. Okay, so it uses two energy every time, so it's, if I hadn't have eaten that food, I would have just died again? I have to find food every time? Like I would have passed out right here. Serious. You want to get nuts? Let's get nuts. Where are we? All right. Well, let's search for some food. We'll buy some. Should be a vending machine inside. The brigade. Du -du -du -du. It shows how much energy it'll take on the movement option. Ah. Closed? Doesn't sound like you're closed. Is this a private party? What's going on in here? Call home. Man, when was the last time you used a phone box? How nostalgic is this? It's me. 
sorry. How could you? When I showed up, you were gone. I got spooked. Well, maybe you shouldn't have called. Leave. You won't need me. Hey, talking to you. This is Patria Calm. The line you are trying to contact has been disconnected. What the hell? That was quick. Yanked the phone out of the wall so hard that it disconnected the entire phone line. So we can sneak in the back. They just made all your phone boxes free around the, your country? That's really cool. They should totally do that. I guess they're used so infrequently it should just be free for people to use. Because you would think anyone using one would be in a bit of a pickle, maybe. Or, you know, have to use it for some reason. So that's how very cool. Pick lock, unlock. Don't have the skills yet. Guess I'm gonna have to try and talk my way in. I do have hacking though, don't I? Need a card. Thought I had a hacking skill. Check trash. Vandalize. Call 96112 if you have information regarding the transmitter. Let's try and smooth talk. Uh uh. Chucks isn't open right now. Renovation. I'm on the list. I hear music in there. Music? No, you don't. Uh, have you met my little friend? There's ten of them. Wow. They are little. <laughs> Ken, let the kid in. Whatever you say, Chuck. Go ahead, kid. I win! Hand over those bills, Robert. Hey, it's John. Well, I'm out. Anyone else want a shot at this guy? Aha, uh -huh. not me. Papa Bear's man an air hockey pack for Satan. <laughs> <gasps> Can we play air hockey? Greetings, all of you. But what about you, kid? I'll play. Yes. We've got ourselves a contender. Points wins. Let's do this. Come on, Papa Bear. Eh. Oh. Oh my god. This takes me back, eh? Oh. Wow, oh, I feel like that's always how I so lose this game. You, <laughs> Listen, that's what happens in real life all the time as well. You do it to yourself. Eh. Let's go. <gasps> oh, oh, gosh. This place is cool. You guys terrorists? I'm not gonna say that. I think this might be the brigade. Uh, uh this is cool. It is, isn't it? Yep. Chucks is our official hangout. Don't go telling the pigs. It's cooler than it looks, young blood. Believe me. Am I in the middle of something? Oh, you're not. It's just that John's still living in the past. Chuck, serve this girl a martyr. Here we go. You sure about that, Robert? Our friend here is practically an adult, aren't you? I'm 14. But, uh, sure. I'm a drink. No energy. Who are you? 
My name is Robert, kid. Nice to meet you. Okay, it's uh, nice to meet you too. You know, I do believe there's a reason you're here today. <clears throat> Maybe you should push on, young bud. It's getting late. Is he missing a finger? Or is that the way it's bent? Listen, you got any advice how to cross the border? Mm, well, it's dangerous. That's for sure. Mm. If I cross, I can help others. I see. Oh, well, get to the border. Then pick a lock. Get in one of the trucks at the gate. And don't make a sound. That part's very important. Uh-huh. Oh, am I? Oh, young bud. Drunk? You at the middle front. Uh what did you put in that drink? The mother? Everything. Please, not my energy. Oh, one left. Kid, wake up. Wake up. <sighs> Martyrs are good. Can I have another one? Haha, <laughs> I see. Haha. <laughs> Come on. I want to show you something. Something big. Uh, listen, I. Oh. Sure. Welcome to the Brigade's secret oh. hideout. Can I get up? <gasps> Food. Finally. Man, wouldn't it be cool to have something like that in your house? John and I were at the border in 86. The brigades have been Imagine for many the years. most wanted terrorists in all of the country being this trusting of a 14 year old child. We have many teen informants. We're hoping one can cross and help us from the other side. I'm in the brigade, and the this is... is one of our biggest achievements. It's a secret the police hideout. are looking for it, but they'll never get their hands on it. We have something special planned for election day. Oh. Wait and see. Uh, you wanted to show me something? Yeah, this. Yeah. What's the kid doing here, Robert? Secret meetings. The kid's political. Besides, aren't we on the lookout for fresh blood? Tree trunk legs. Who are the brigade? The brigade are the people behind the attack that is at the start that they talk about every time. And it's like the anniversary of it. Um, they're freedom fighters slash terrorists, depending on how you look at it. This is so cool. It is. You know, you could become a brigade if you wanted to. What? Nothing's stopping you. I'll start the meeting. Look, it's now or never to elevate our game. I have a plan to rig a Tyrak billboard. As this is we'll a fictional country under a tyranny. A fake signal. When they arrive, boom, Tyrak. we trigger the device. This isn't a huge move, but it's a good start and will send a strong message. Do I have any volunteers? Sure, I'll do it. That's great, kid. But I think we'll go with hardened brigades here. I'll do it, Robert. This isn't who we are. They're sending teens to the work camp, John. Protests aren't cutting it. And Flores sure as hell won't cut it either. Robert's right. We need to attack. Now. Alex, our little genius, will help us break <gasps> the device. If all goes well, Alex we works for you guys? bigger and badder for election day. The kid's out, Robert. He doesn't want to be involved in this. For Christ's sakes, his mom's a cop. We don't need Alex. We can find somebody else to do this. I'm telling you all, violence will do more harm than good. Funny, don't you think, kid? Why? Funny because John and his girlfriend were the ones who drove the truck to kill Tyrak in 86. I've changed, Robert. Yes. John was the have. one behind that attack? Look, we should vote and settle this right now. Who thinks the brigades need to be more aggressive? I don't. I do. I do. I refrain. I don't. I don't. I do. Free against free. Let's ask the kid. Don't make... She's here you're not going to make me a deciding mm, vote. That's why you brought her in. To vote on your side. Incredible. 
Kid, what do you think? In a... Uh, I mean... It's a very difficult thing. In terms of freedom fighting and stuff, but... You know, I think John knows... I trust this character. I think John has, like, a really good heart and knows what's up. So I'm actually going to side with him over this other guy and say that violence isn't the answer like John wants. You blew it, kid. I thought you had the makings of a real brigade. We side with Papa Bear. Seems like a good guy, you know? Guys, picked it up in the scanner. I'm just a kid. The police on their way. We all know what we need to do. Get in our cars and leave calmly. Kid, no need to worry. They'll never suspect you. Hey, kid, want to play? Yes. We can put down some money if you want. Sure. You ready to lose? $20. I've only got $29. I'm going to put 20 of it on this game against you. Let's play. Time to get rich. And I'll be able to... Ah! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, God. Come on! Please! I can't... No! What? This is so much of my money! Right, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Yes. There you go. I got the skills! I got the skills! I'm unstoppable. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go! Bringing it back. 2-2. Two, two. All or nothing. Hiya! Oh! Okay, you win. Fair and square. You got shot, sweetheart. Money. Another game? Yeah. No. It's not for money. No. <sighs> well. So these are the tapes that we've collected so far. Well, wow, there's quite a few. That's pretty cool. Cassettes. So what nostalgic. 1992. Hmm. Um. Oh, well, I just won. So do you know what? I, w I would like some food and a drink. Thank you. I'm going to go out the back. Was it just daytime for a second and then quickly went back to night? Or was that my eyes? <laughs> Right, um, let's call a taxi. See if we meet our friend again. Now that we have some money. Happy taxi, how can we help you today? Shouldn't it be happy taxi, how can we make you happy? But uh, I need a ride. We'll send a taxi to your location right away. Thanks. Thank you for calling happy taxi. Uber, you know. Yeah, Appy Taxi, innit? See, there's the president. You know he's bad because he's on a red background, so... That's how it works. Alright, 50% of Zoe's story? It feels like that's not a lot. I've met her twice, and that's 50%, right? That's why I'm curious to see what happens once you get past a certain point, if you have to repeat stuff. Oh yeah, it is him. What's up, K-Flu? <clears throat> Hello? The psychopath. Um, hello, sir. <laughs> Sorry, forgot you were back there. That was really creepy, man. So where are we headed today with Happy Taxi? Oh, can you not do that with the mirror? That's I'm just going north. Than just north it is. Now sit back and enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Oh god. Okay. I think that's a picture of his daughter that he was telling us about. 
See if there's anything else in here. Look, he's got the dinosaur magazines back here. Kind of cute. Little plant. Can't be all bad. I mean, who keeps a plant if they're evil, right? We would not fall asleep in this taxi, though. Where does this look like? Oh, there's the big, um, that mountain is the border, so we, we're getting pretty close. Um. <clears throat> Are you watching me sleep, or? Oh, what's this? that belong to the last customer sketches for the mess of an explosive device he left that behind too a hat was uh who was wearing that hat alex wasn't wearing that hat it's a bit strange i can see why you would say that they forgot many things not a lot gets by you i can tell by the way, everything I'm telling you is the truth. Did you... We're called Happy Taxi. Kill them? But we could be called Honest Taxi, too. Maybe you have some questions about the road. I can help you with those. Oh, there is a bit an element of uh, Clint in there, actually, isn't there? I saw the trailer for his last movie that's coming out. Not that it's going to be his last, but I mean, he's pretty old, I'm just saying. Um, he's like 97 now, and he's still directing and acting and stuff, which is incredible. I loved Gran Torino. I thought that was a great film. Um, and The Mule wasn't bad either. Take many teens to the border? No? Just puts the window up on you. <laughs> Final destination style. His cold anger. Jared's cold anger. Hey, what's on the radio? You shouldn't be this close to me. Hey, what's this? I have that for a Why do you have cups? Project. What's that about? What did what's this do? Can I have that tape? Hey, what's this? That's not for your eyes. Can I take this dinosaur? Now sit back and stay seated. Enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Just being as annoying. Um, is there someone in the in the boot of your car? Is there someone in the trunk, sir? No. Because <gasps> he's anti-brigade. Oh my god, he picked up a brigade member, and sorry, I didn't. There's definitely someone in there. Turn the music up now. Okay. Do you like dinosaurs? Love them. Love them. Can't get enough of them. I mean, this is the year Jurassic Park comes out. We're all dinosaur crazy, right? 1996. Something weird's happening, though. I don't think so. Did you say something? That was my stomach. Oh. I see. You know? Never mind. Did you- Oh no. I think I have a flat Did tire. you just lock the door? Better take a look. Okay. Sit tight. Okay. <laughs> Who's gonna kill me? Shh. Go back to sleep. It's fine. You scared me. <laughs> you don't wanna die! No. <laughs> 60 second countdown, what's that? What did I say about oh god. The um, I'll have that, thank you, and I will unlock the door, and I will honk maybe, did that do anything? No, that's probably a, I'll be leaving now, I think. Should I wait? Should I wait? Maybe I'll wait, I mean, it seems, you know, this isn't a, am I next? If I stay here, am I in trouble? He sounds crazy. He's hitting him a lot. You know, it, like there's a few, there's, there's a line. I, I think you're crossing it. 
at this point. All right, I'll be going now. Cleverness. It's like, hey, you have, you're pretty smart. Oh. Just running along an open road. Guy's got a car, oh, right? That. And that's cleverness. Impressive. <laughs> Just beats the guy for another five minutes and then pulls up alongside me. Mm. Alright, nearly at the border. Good thing we had the uh, food and drink. Road 96. We have a big week for indies this week. We have uh, this today. We've got ambition this week as well. I can share that from tomorrow, so we'll do that Wednesday probably, or it'll be on YouTube on Wednesday. That dating game. Can I get around there? That was where I was before. And uh, 12 minutes on Friday. And we've got Lake as well. So a lot to get through. A lot to check out. A lot of exciting stuff. Big old month for indie games. It's pretty cool, all this, all this stuff coming out now that we played demos for like three months ago. Love it. Oh my god, that's I did that on my first run and it's here. That's so cool. I'm a different person now. I'll do uh, Revolution. So each of your characters that makes it, you get to add to the graffiti at the border. That's pretty cool. I'm really excited for 12 minutes. That game has been in development for so long. There's very, very old, like, beta test footage of it from, like, five, six years ago, and it looks like a completely different game. And it's really cool to see... Oh, leave money for others. I guess I'll leave 20... I mean, I might need this to get it over the thing, but I guess that's something you can do if you make a ton of money on the way. I only have 20 bucks as it is, though. We're not out of the woods yet. So it's cool to see that now, you know, coming out on Annapurna, and they've got James McAvoy, Daisy Ridley, and Willem Dafoe doing voices in it. It is pretty crazy. And we love an interactive movie. He's everyone's favorite character so far. I think Alex is pretty cool, and I like John. Yeah, we should do another demo day soon. Check out some more strips. At the border. Now, he gave us advice about picking a lock and jumping in the back of a truck. Maybe we'll try that this time. In the first episode, I went over the mountain, and that took a really long time. So we're going to try and sneak into a truck this time. Snacks and drinks? Hi. Can I help you at all? Can I help you? Uh, what are you doing here? I wanted to cross, but I don't have enough money for a coyote. Maybe I'll just... <laughs> I don't have enough money for a coyote. Can't give up, not now. I don't have enough money to give you. Maybe you're right. Thanks for the pep talk. I don't have enough money for a Don Quixote. So I'll stay here and die. Hey, uh I'll have a fortune pig. Hey guys, this is your Monday fortune for the rest of your week, okay? This is an omen. Thank you and good luck, oink. Okay, well. <clears throat> Can I have my three bucks back? That's... Alright, I'm gonna have a little bit of food. Thanks. See you later. Thanks for nothing. Scam. Ah, oh, I didn't have a lockpick. 
Damn it. Hey, do you know I can get across? Kid, you gotta show more discretion. There are guards here who'd like nothing more than to arrest us. There's the wall. Sorry. Can we trust you? Yeah, of course. Okay. You could try to convince a guard to let you enlist. You seem smart. Just follow the line of trucks to the gate. I do have smarts. I hope you find your freedom, kid. I am we'll smart. Alright. Thanks. Let's try that this time then. So it looks like there's three or so ways to get across. Ooh, I can force myself into a truck too. So that was John's advice. Is to cram into a truck. I've done going over the mountain. That's on YouTube. We can pick locks, but because we have the cleverness, I'm going to go and talk to a guard and see what happens. Is this your truck? Yeah. Why? No reason. If you say so. I guess you can try and convince someone to hide you. Here for the offshore worker exam? I sure is. Are you registered? I am. Everything looks in order. You can head inside. I think you can call that number and actually report the radio and get the reward in it. Oh my god, it's like being back at school. <clears throat> Welcome. You're here for the offshore worker test. If you fail, it's because you have lied and you will be detained. It's too late to leave. Try and you will also be detained. The test will be difficult. Only the most honest citizens will pass. Mm -hmm. Your number will be displayed behind me. When it appears, it's your turn. Your test results will also be displayed there. So pay attention. There are certain requirements you need to know. Only married persons with at least one child can rightfully apply. Your Why? Pass, you pass, <laughs> what a, what a strange rule. Years. No more, no less. Lastly, the majority of your pay will be sent back to your homeland. Your number will soon be displayed. Bless our beautiful nation. Bless. Is that me? I don't know what my number is. I wasn't given a number, sir. What are you doing? Uh, Your number's on the screen. So, Get in there. Right. Ready? Nine six one one two. Vote for Tyrek. Nation to close door on attack September 9th, 10 years after the Cowardly Brigade attack. The nation will honor the victims who died that terrible day and elect its next president. Hundreds are expected for the nationally televised event. Uh, of course, I was born ready, sir. Quiet. Uh. Let us begin. Question one. What is your candidate number? 13, sir. Question two. How old is your eldest child? Uh, five. Strange. You look very young. You know. Don't get Question much sun. Three. If you pass, how long will your stay abroad be? Five years, I think. Question four. What age Was that a your scream? child be when you return from abroad? Ten. Question five. Are you or have you ever been a black brigade? Oh, those guys that I met. Uh no. Question six. Have you ever listened to illegal radio stations? I would never do Be anything honest. illegal, sir. Question seven. When did the Black Brigade terrorist attack occur? Regular Kaiser Soze sat here. Uh, September 9th, 10 years ago, 86. Question eight. Who is Sonia Sanchez? Only the greatest TV news anchor of all time. Question nine. Who is our great president? Mr. Tyrak. Question ten. I mean, President Tyrant. What percent Tyrek. of your pay will be sent back to Petra oh, as a tribute to your homeland? I wasn't listening. Um, I did hear something about pay going back. Was it fifty percent or seventy percent or was it thirty percent? Oh no! Does anyone remember? Do you guys remember? Oh my God! I'm glad there's no timer on this. Um, I think it was fifty. 
but I don't know. 70, you think? Okay, two people saying 70. Let's go with 70. That's, it sounds excessive, but maybe like what they would do, right? Question 11. Which of the following do you enjoy the most? Reading fantasy literature, writing to a foreign pen pal, patrolling with the patriotic youth. Last question. Have you answered all questions truthfully? I already know, but I want to hear it from you. I have lied completely and entirely and without remorse. You can now wait for your test results in the waiting room. Hopefully you'll not be arrested. Good day. Bye. I think I aced it. Only one I'm unsure about is the percentage, but I trust you guys. You look young to take this test. <sighs> Thanks. That wasn't really a compliment. All right. Shut up. Don't worry. I won't say anything. God, I hope he passes us. I would imagine this is very much like kids signing up for war back in the day. Where they don't really care. 13, pass, there you go. All I do is win, baby. Number 13, you have passed. Stand up and leave. Yeah. And may you well represent our blessed nation. I will. We made it. Freedom. Nothing is more important but there are many others in Petra still looking for it. Another kid makes it over the border. That's two over, one arrested. Not bad. And their journeys have only just begun. I feel like that's Zoe narrating, isn't it?